One thing that I see a lot with accelerators and entrepreneurs in general is thinking about maybe you got to $2 million in your coaching business, you're doing some one-on-one, but you're going to $5 million. Does $5 million me coach one-on-one? I'm guessing yeah. probably that's not part of the business model. Maybe, yeah. but probably not, right? It's not as scalable as like maybe a group or a membership or something like that. So not that you make that decision overnight, but you start moving your business towards that. Like, oh, one-on-one is probably not part of this business model. So I'm going to have to start transitioning into this other business model that I see I can make $5 million with. Yeah, And that's going to bring all of your mindset stuff up, all of it. <laughs> You know, this isn't what most people think about when they're planning the year. Most people are thinking like, oh, yeah, I'm going to set a goal of a million dollars next year or 500,000 or whatever it might be and say, okay, I'm going to break it down by quarter. I need to do this, this and this to do this. But like what most people don't think about is exactly what you just brought up. When we think about that bigger goal and we start to be thinking, oh, I need to be making decisions through this lens, then it brings up a whole bunch of mindset yeah. stuff. So let's talk about that for a second. What types of things does it bring up? Well, it really brings to the surface all of the belief they're like your own mindset beliefs that are like your glass ceilings i call them glass ceilings because it's hard for you to see for yourself until you put yourself into a situation where it rises to the surface right then you're like oh <laughs> I don't believe I can make $5 million or $5 million isn't possible for me, or I can't let my one-on-ones go, or I can't make this transition, or I can't make this change. All of the things that you believe now are the things that got you to where you are, but many of those things will limit you from getting to the next level. And that's really like one of the whole points of setting a goal like this is for you to see very clearly what are those things. Maybe they were great for me now, but I have to let them go in order to move to the next level. 